Today in Crypto The Intercontinental Exchange, NYSE, ICE, the owner of the New York Stock Exchange and Institutional Cryptocurrency Exchange backed, announced a deal that would see its crypto arm listed on the stock markets. As reported by the Wall Street Journal, Bact is set to merge with VPC Impact Acquisition Holdings. Trading under the ticker VVPC is a so-called Special Purpose Acquisition Company, or SPAC. It is a shell company whose only purpose is to buy or merge with another company and allow it to be listed on the stock markets without going through the lengthy and expensive process of an initial public offering. Continue reading on Coin Telegraph. Popular stable coin Tether USTT, is the first token to go live on the Herms Layer 2 network, the company announced on Monday. As part of the collaboration, batched USTT transactions will be possible once the Herms network officially launches in early 2021. David Schwartz, project lead at Herms, told Cointelegraph continue reading on Cointelegraph. The incoming Biden administration's plan to flood the U.S. economy with trillions of dollars could ignite the next leg of the Bitcoin BTC, bull market, as more investors seek refuge from a crumbling United States dollar. Oxios, an Arlington-based news outlet, reported Thursday that Joe Biden has asked Congress to provide Americans with $2,000 in stimulus payments to help offset the economic devastation of COVID-19. The incoming president has also proposed a $3 trillion tax and infrastructure package as part of his Build Back Better program. Continue reading on Cointelegraph. The incoming Biden administration's plan to flood the U.S. economy with trillions of dollars could ignite the next leg of the Bitcoin BTC bull market, as more investors seek refuge from the crumbling United States dollar. Oxios, an Arlington-based news outlet, reported Thursday that Joe Biden has asked Congress to provide Americans with $2,000 in stimulus payments to help offset the economic devastation of COVID-19. The incoming president has also proposed a $3 trillion tax and infrastructure package as part of his Build Back Better program. Continue reading on Cointelegraph. Bitcoin price is trading at over $33,000 at the time of this writing, but that's nearly $9,000 away from the high it set days ago. And while the cryptocurrency is still well above 2020 prices, the asset's largest ever daily candle in terms of total price move is forming and it is shaping up to be bearish. What does this mean for the bull market that was brewing, and how bad could this correction get? Bitcoin started 2021 off on a tier, closing out the year of the pandemic on an extremely high note. In fact, the cryptocurrency closed 2020 at a price almost five times what it started the year off from. Inflation fears in the wake of unprecedented money printing have led investors to assets like gold and Bitcoin. High wealth individuals are scrambling for ways to protect capital and the economic uncertainty to come and many are now speculating that the cryptocurrency will do the job better than the precious metal will. Related reading, Bitcoin weekly relative strength more powerful than record 2017 rally The waterfall of gold funds flowing into Bitcoin combined with the assets limited supply sent prices into the stratosphere in the final quarter of 2020. In just months, Bitcoin rose from $10,000 to a high of right below $42,000. The rally caught the attention of not only finance but the entire world. The way up was characterized by record-breaking weekly and monthly candles, a sign of what was to come, analysts concluded. However, Bitcoin is now about to set another record for the largest daily candle historically, and unfortunately, it is happening on the way back down. Bitcoin is both notorious and sought for its parabolic moves. Getting in ahead of them results in life-changing wealth. Buying the top sometimes leads to years of losses before things heat up once again. And when they do get going, the strength of the trend can quickly leave buyers behind. The leading cryptocurrency by market cap has potentially just completed a parabolic advance as indicated by the largest ever daily corrective candle, currently at roughly $7,200 from wick to wick. Related reading, Google Trend Sentiment Breaks Down. Will Bitcoin follow? Because Bitcoin's bubble effect is so easily recognized, and both the price of the asset and supporting exuberance reached substantially higher heights than the last bull run. But like a double-edged sword, 
It also could worsen the selling initially. No one wants to be left holding the bag like in 2017, which has resulted in a large chunk of profit taking, panic selling, and a cascade of long liquidated. The psychology of a parabolic move broken could lead investors to believe another bear market is next. But that belief a bear market is coming could create the ideal sentiment shift for a shakeout of epic proportions. Institutions that are accustomed to buying the blood will be doing just that in preparation for yet another parabolic wave. If that occurs, this wasn't the long term top, and despite any aggressive sell off, another parabolic wave will arrive before the end of the year. Hit the like button and subscribe to the channel.